got the button mower. It's been a while since I've had a chance to work on it. Um, I have ordered a bunch of fun new parts for it. We've got all kinds of new belts. See, this one's deck blade to blade. This is deck drive belt. Uh, we actually actually got some new front caster wheels for it. Uh, one of these is actually bent. I decided just to go ahead and buy the pair. And uh, one thing I want to mention is the issues with the belt. Well, it looks like it had the correct belt on it. I think it was just, I was not using it properly. And uh, it is kind of worn though, because I bought the new belt. We got the old belt. And if you look at the old belt, you can see the old belt's a little bigger than the new belt. It probably got a little stretched out over the years. Um, it's cracking in the middle. It's actually worn on the ends. These teeth on the new one are actually a lot bigger than the teeth on this one. So we got a new drive belt, but the belts have to come off and get put on in a particular order. We're not going to mess with the belts today um, because you actually have to do the, this is the first belt to come off and then the last belt to go on. I'm going to replace all the belts. Uh, right now I need to get another wheel drive belt. I only have one for the, the side wheels and you get two. What I'm going to work on today, though, is right here, the air filter cover. I got the air filter. It was missing a few parts, and, well, I bought replacements for those, so we're going to work on that today. I'm just having a really fun time because I have a space derby track sitting in my garage you now, going on a week that hasn't gone in the Cubs Cup closet yet, but that's neither here nor there for you guys. So you can see the air filter is in pretty rough shape. We bought a new air filter. There was some parts missing. One of the parts, which I found, is this little screw here that screws into the bottom of the carburetor and will create a hole if it's not in there. So I went ahead and I actually was able to find it. That that screw was sitting on top of the deck, and I don't know for how long, just loose, but I just happened to find it. It made it all the way the hour and a half from the auction house here. It made it through the forklift drives. It made it from wherever it was before the auction house there, probably. It, it, it's had its run. Um, and then we got the air cleaner cover here. But what we needed was a few other parts. So this is a cover that actually goes on top of the air filter inside the air cup cleaner because the air cleaner sucks the air up through here and then pulls it through the filter to go down into the carburetor. So that all has to be sealed off. And then we got a, the screw that actually holds it, goes through all of that and the lid and holds everything down. There's another one here which I have not gotten yet, but I, I think I should be able to pull off at least with the work with the one. Let me put a piece of tape on that. I'm wondering if I can just find a screw that will screw into this piece down here because that's how it actually works. And just, kind of just a, use a normal screw instead of spending the 15, 20 bucks or whatever they want for that particular screw. So we're going to go ahead and put this together. And uh, to get the next step taken care of here. So we're going to open up our brand new air filter
Okay, so what I did is I took it all apart again because I found these sitting in my stash of, it was just sitting on my workbench. They're actually in two different sizes. I got one inch and one inch and a quarter. I think these are for some lights that I ended up actually throwing out. But they work, they fit, seem to be the same thread. So, just they seem to be a little too long. At least for this end. So, probably gonna have to trim some off to get it going. Because these are the shorter ones. All right, well, I'll go, so. However, we got the, at least it all be held down on one side instead of, instead of just kind of floating there like it was before. I think I'll be able to fix that with some just some standard hardware. So another another progress done, and we know pretty much where we got to go from here. So okay, air filter's done. It's kind of a pain, but uh, we learned something, and uh, we're gonna make better next time. So, until next time, which I don't know when that's going to be. Um, so, but until then, we at least got an air filter on there. And the cover's on there somewhat good. We do have one screw holding the whole thing on. So, that's a plus. <laughs>